Hello there, this is Anastasia Bizzarri, Real Estate with an Accent, and today I want to share with you a very easy way to take years off the age of your home, and that way is by using accent swaps. So let me walk you through the right way to do it, how to choose the right colors, and uh, let's have fun with it. Accent swaps can be used for many different purposes. And in this case, the accent wall has been used to complement a earthy decor. So you can see that all the colors here are very earthy from the wall behind. It's kind of neutral, but it complements the earthy colors of the wood, the, the beige of the carpet, the pillows. So that's one way to use accent wall. Another way to use accents colors is to correct some small defects that we can see in a room. This room, for example, it's a living room that has a really nice opening to what we think is a garden, but the ceilings are kind of low. So uh, by putting an accent wall that takes more or less two thirds of the wall and painting the rest of the room on the upper side, uh, the same color of the ceiling, we get these feelings that the ceiling is a little bit higher than what it is. So that's a very good correction. And as you can see, there's also a desire to bring inside the same colors that are outside. And so while the, the core of this room is earthy, the colors that have been used are cool colors like that sage green on the wall. And they tend to create a sense of freshness, relaxation inside a room. So that's a very good example. Another way to use accents walls is to really put an accent in the room. So in this case, there's a little bit of bravery going on in picking a color that is quite bright. But as you can see, works very well with uh, the color of the floor and the colors of the details of the wood um, on the top and uh, the off-white that is used for the bookshelf. So it is a bright color, but it's also a cool color. It's a shade of blue with um, a little bit of turquoise in it. So it, it recalls the water and uh, therefore gives you a sense of coolness that is so required in places like Florida, where I live and work. We also consider accents walls a completely different material used for the wall. Uh, this wall has been, probably this was the original wall that has been brought out and uh, that's the way it looks. It's still considered an accent wall because in the end it's a different material and creates this fact of you know, more depth in the wall. And it's a white on white, but because the texture is different, it looks like it's almost a different color. That's another way to add an accent to a room. And now we're moving on to a completely different way of using accents on walls, wallpapers. Take a look. Well, in this case, it's, it's the wallpaper has been used almost like a canvas to make this room that as you can see, as a kind of a dark paint, uh, brighter and uh, bring the outside inside the room. So this depiction of nature that you can see on the walls is divided in a trip, if you want the triptychal, even though it's made of different canvases, but it's still wallpaper, probably printed in fabric. And it creates this very, I would say beautiful uh, sense of bringing nature inside a room. This is a, a bedroom and it looks really fantastic. It often happens that we have bathrooms with no windows. So how about creating the windows with a trump layer? Or like in this case, um, it could be, obviously it could be painted, but in this case it is a wallpaper that recreates the window. So you get the sense that behind that bathtub there is a window when in fact it's wallpaper but it creates this sense of you know depth and also um, adds on to the room by uh, bringing in the colors that are typical of nature so the blue of the sky the greens and there are some flowers uh, blown up but again it's all about the, the feeling that a room gives you and this works very well it's an outdoor bathroom, even though it has no windows. 
And since we are in the mood for adding things that are a little bit exceptional, why not reproducing a Van Gogh painting on uh, a wallpaper? So this is Starry Night, and uh, it has been reproduced in wallpaper. And in this case, has been used for an office, and it looks really great because it's an accent on a wall that is otherwise neutral and uh, creates a wonderful backdrop for the desk. And so why not daring even more and putting one of the most famous paintings by Vermeer, the girl with the pearl earring, which is uh, this combination of a back, black backdrop with a very, um, with this portrait that is full of light, the image of this lady that is full of light. And uh, in this case, she's overlooking a reading area, but it creates a really nice ensemble. So wallpapers nowadays can go really creative and uh, I would say wildly creative. And so you can think about using wallpaper as well for accents walls. I hope you enjoyed these few ideas on how you can make your house look totally different by just changing a wall. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Please stay tuned. I love posting videos about the core and uh, feel free to uh, ask questions or if you have any particular interest, just let me know and I'll see what I can do in creating a video. See you soon. Bye.